Archer, on Friday at 11 p.m., this Irish MEP will be kicked out of this parliament against the democratic wishes of the people of Ireland who voted to remain and who want to stay in the EU. After 47 years of membership and after 50 years of fighting against gerrymandering in places like Derry, the British government is once again kicking our voting rights away taking them away from us and once again changing the constitutional position of the people of Ireland without our consent. Today, I am voting in favour of this Irish protocol because Sinn Féin will not consent to the hardening of the British border partition in Ireland. We will not consent to custom posts. We will not consent to barbed wire. There is no doubt that the Irish protocol in the withdrawal agreement is an ugly compromise, but it's better than a crash-out Brexit. However, partition and Brexit are ugly impositions that have burdened Ireland for years. Because of partition, Brexit is stripping away our democratic and social rights. But because of Brexit, a dynamic conversation about Irish unity has been invigorated. The EU Council made its contribution to Irish unity when, on the 29th of April 2017, 27 member states agreed that if Ireland is reunified, the whole of Ireland is in the EU. The partition of Ireland is not only a problem for us in Ireland. The 300 mile border with 320 border crossings is now your problem too. When Britain gets its empire back, showing it cares nothing about your level playing field. And when shady, low-standard products with minimum protection make their way into your market, you will not be long in joining the sensible people in supporting Irish unity. There is no doubt that a day will come when Irish MEPs from the North will be back in the European Parliament. Mark my words. Chucky and La Shin. I'm really sorry, but you've overrun significantly. We move now to our next speaker for one minute, Mr. Kola Kusic.